fears are the veil that prevents you from going beyond your beliefs. If you do not go beyond your beliefs, there is no place else for you to go except to continually repeat what you've already been experiencing in a different shape or form, with different faces and places. But it will be exactly the same. And if you can maintain the illusion of different places, shapes, people, and forms, you will have the illusion that you've done something different, but the energy and the essence of it will have never changed. You have to be willing to question and move beyond your beliefs in order to have a different experience. Otherwise, you are condemning yourself to the same old perpetual experience in a different hologram, in a different illusion, in a different set of circumstances. You can get this all intellectually, but if you don't do anything about it, and you do not push yourself beyond your beliefs and through the fears, nothing will change. Remember, the fears are the veil that prevents you from going beyond your beliefs. Your fears are, in a way, what your patterns have designed to keep you contained in the belief system that you're limited in. So, an image is, you have this belief system about the way life is, and you're afraid of certain outcomes and experiences. The fears are what traps you in that belief system. And it creates an illusion of solidity, permanency, and pain. And you have been trained over time to know that you don't want pain and you want pleasure, but won't go through pain to get pleasure. So if it's painful, you won't move forward. And once that program has been set, then it is often very difficult for a person to move into their awareness or their consciousness because they believe the veil of pain, they believe the veil of fear to be true and real. So when they get close to it, they back off. And dabblers will stick their fingers through the veil and believe they are having pain and retract back into their patterns and on the other side into their limitations. And the illusion of the pain and the program of the fear is too intimidating to move through and beyond. Fear is simply a semi-transparent curtain of nothingness that appears to be something that you're not deciding to pass through. And the pain you experience when you push yourself through your fears is all illusionary also. Because your belief in that pain and the expectation of the pain is so strong, even though you're walking through a transparent veil with no weight, you are experiencing pain because you believe the pain will be experienced. And if you fear the illusionary pain enough, you will never pass through the veil to your freedom. So at this point, it is when you have to decide, are you going to face your illusions and learn that even when you walk through the veil of fear, the pain that you are feeling is also an illusion and a creation of your own, or not. If you decide to walk through it, yes, you may experience some pain. But with your wisdom, remember that the pain you are feeling while passing through the veil of fear is not real. It is real because you believed it to be so. That's how powerful a creator you are. And when you get on the other side of the veil, you can realize that you can create anything and you're no longer trapped by the veil of fear. You are in an open space, and everything beyond that place is anything you want it to be. Pain or pleasure, neutrality or joy, anything you want it to be, because you have stepped into the world of creation. 
and left behind the veil of fear, which was only an illusion created by you and your beliefs, your programming, your training, and your doubt of self. <laughs>